Okay, the new sensation, four bats from a notorious Southern Dallas neighborhood called Highland Hill. Some men in Dallas say they are protecting and serving. They're not trying to replace police, but sometimes they're armed. Thanks for joining us. I'm Cynthia Segeva. And I'm Chris Lawrence. The men say they're protecting their community, and you can find them patrolling the streets in Oak Cliff, specifically the area around Highland Hills. Rebecca Lopez went to check it out. Anybody in the apartment? They say they are tired of crime here. Come on out. So they're taking matters into their own hands. So we're not here policing or being security guards. We, we're coming in as brothers. They call themselves community engagement activists. They have armed themselves and openly carry weapons around the Highland Park apartments in Southern Dallas. And they work in shifts. They're looking to stop trouble and crime. We're not trying to uh, come out here and uh, police anybody. We're not trying to um, um, intimidate anybody. We just want to let them know that we're an extra resource that they have uh, in terms of their safety and security. Like this is one of our problem vacant apartments. For a month, they've been patrolling. They say not once have they seen any of the DPS troopers who are helping Dallas police with the summer crime. And they say DPD officers take too long to get here when they need them. The apartment management welcomes them. Billboard broke the story he signed with OVO. I had some inside knowledge that the remix with Drake was in his inventory. I've seen Nick, two Nick. stories on YouTube about the mystery of his success. One of them, the Nick. motherfucker was just reading tweets, and the other was the better option in much more detail. So I'll scan some of his talking points. Four bats has a total of Nick. three singles, all garnering millions of plays. He's caught the attention of Kanye West and Drake, which many of you know. Wouldn't surprise me if they there was kind of a cold bidding war between them to get to bats. Kanye kind of just went off on Drake. So no telling how him signing with OVO will affect his relationship with Ye. It probably will. He was on a fucking video chat with Mr. West. Nick. Kanye called him the next son of God type shit. But out Four here in bats. Dallas, where you can find me, nobody knows who the fuck this guy is. His social media platforms were created in the last four months, including his Facebook, which went online in January of this year year. Look, Andy's already passed Big X the plug in Spotify numbers, who everybody felt was the face of Dallas. But now, hell, I guess even we don't know what the fuck is going on anymore, or what we're talking about. And we live here. I'm connected to every blog in Dallas. I've never heard of this guy. Bats hasn't had a live show here. No one in Highland Hills knows of him, unless you're in his circle since I've seen him push Don Don the Stepper in his stories. Yo! Where you from? Don't know the I'm from Holly Hills. But, but that doesn't take away any of his accomplishments. And you know how I dig into shit. I can't find a fucking family member, a op, a school picture, nothing. And with the OVO shit, a lot of people in the Metroplex didn't really celebrate it. But we don't know how to because what do we know about Nico Bibby? We can't even classify him as a headliner. Not with this song index. Three singles, his music concert was started and he ended the six minute mark. I could brew one cup of coffee in that amount of time, bruh. Leave a comment.